I mean, I think you've got to be realistic on, on looks and pre-snap looks that you want to give a quarterback and maybe that a younger player that you might be able to bait into a throw where you're not going to be able to do that with a more experienced player that's probably seen a lot of those looks before. Uh, you got to be careful, especially in terms of never let disguise put you out of position, which that's what happens sometimes when you try and get too cute and disguise things and all of a sudden you can't get yourself in the half field and you got a problem. But, uh, you know, I don't know that, you know, we've got to, you know, make him make more decisions post-snap as, as opposed to pre-snap. And sometimes with younger quarterbacks, they're, they're just lucky to get their eyes in the right spots. Uh, so pre-snap, you know, uh, disguise isn't, isn't as important as maybe it is with an older player. What can you learn about maybe watching that game live instead of watching I flow of the game. You know, not right now with so many, you know, people offensively with tempo and different things. What is the flow of the game? How is the game being administered? Uh, you know, get a good feel that, you know, obviously they play extremely hard. It's easier sometimes to see that uh, when you're watching the TV copy as opposed to maybe a coach's copy uh, that we see. Uh, but those, those things to me are, are easy to see.